So hi, my name is Jeff Keitlinger. I'm the general manager of the Metropolitan Water District of Southern California. We're the folks that bring a little more than half of Southern California's water from a long ways away to 19 million people. And I'm here with my friend Andy Lipkiss. And I'm Andy Lipkiss, president of Tree People. We're a local nonprofit organization that's working to source half of Los Angeles water from the rainfall and conservation. Our job is to inspire and engage people to participate as making a sustainable future for Los Angeles. So we're here, uh, we're gonna take this ice bucket challenge to raise funds for ALS. One of California's great water leaders, Steve Hall of the Association of California Water Agencies, he passed from ALS a few years ago. Now originally we were wondering about throwing water around during a drought, but Andy came up with the idea that we should water trees while we're doing it, and now we're doing it in an environmentally drought responsible way. We're being water wise. The water you're about to see came from my shower this morning. Uh, buckets in the shower, as we do every morning, it's about to uh, get re-showered. And water trees that are drought stressed all over Southern California. So you can do the same. Capture your water from rain, from your shower, conserve it, get it to the trees that really need help right now. So now we're going to challenge a few folks of our own. I'm going to take on the water community. My first challenge is going to be the chairman of our board of directors, Randy Record from the Eastern Municipal Water District. I'm going to challenge Randy Fiorini, a longtime friend of Steve Hall's, and he's the chairman of the Delta Stewardship Council. And finally, I'm going to take on the rest of the MWD managers, all our member agencies that serve water from Ventura down to San Diego. I want all you guys to do this as well. And I'm going to reach out to some of the nonprofit leaders in town working as part of the Partnership for Water Conservation and Resilience. Oh, Nancy Steele, head of the Council for Watershed Health. Ruskin Hartley, head of Heal the Bay. Steve Fleischley, the water leader for the Natural Resources Defense Council. And I was only allowed three, but all the other people conserving water invite you to join us too. All right, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> that was cold. <laughs> we don't always agree, <laughs> but for the cause of saving people and health, we're together. And in this drought. Thanks, Andy. <laughs> <laughs>